We're at Craggy Bushland, which is about 20 kilometres north of Perth. And Craggy Bushland is managed by the city of Joondalup. So Craggy Bushland is really unique in that the city of Joondalup decided um, in about 2010 to put up a predator-proof fence. So they've put up a fence all the way around the bushland and working with DBCA, a conservation translocation of Quenda occurred in um, late 2013. And we've been monitoring this population of Quenda. Now one of the problems with um, translocating mammals into a urban bushland reserve is that oftentimes it means the bushland reserve is disconnected from other habitat. So Craigie bushland is in a sea of urbanisation and it's surrounded by houses. So the quenda that live here are unlikely to be able to move to another habitat. So that's a management problem for down the track. One of the great things about working in an urban bushland is it's quite close to the city, so it's really convenient for field work. But the other thing is that you get to meet a lot of people. We, while we're trapping Quenda and monitoring the populations and examining how they change the environment, we get to interact with all sorts of members of the public. A lot of people come up to us while we're working and talk to us about the Quenda that they've seen. And people are really interested in looking for Quenda. That's a wonderful benefit, is being able to interact with interested people. The translocation of Quenda to Craggy Bushland has been really successful. We have a really good population of Quenda here. We originally translocated about 43 individuals and now we have well over 150 individuals. They're all in excellent health and they seem to be breeding. They're digging up a lot of the soil here. They're really changing the um, microhabitat in Craggy Bushland and we're really fascinated to see what that might mean for the environment down the track.